Little Blackie was able to convince some friends today to help him with our math lesson. And we're turning to worksheet 75-1-1 on page 303. And we get to make some receipts today. So go ahead and write your name at the top, please. So, and we're going to write today's date. So I'm going to write Little Blackie's name. Um, first name and last name up here. And remember that I'm putting a space in between, okay? It's easier to read that way. Okay, then um, I'm writing today's date. So we're still in the month of May. So that's a capital M-A-Y. It's the, short, the shortest um, number of letters in a month. So May and today is the 18th. So I'm gonna put a finger space and a one and an eight and then a comma. And the year is 2020, 2020. Okay, we're going, we're going to make two receipts today. And the first place we're going to is the cat store. So we have to just write cat at the top. C-A-T. So it's the cat store, okay? So here we go. Who did he bring first? Why? It's Grumpy Cat. And if you turn Grumpy Cat over, he agreed to wear a price tag today. And his price tag is 52 cents. So first we have to write Grumpy on the line, which is G R U M P Y. And then we have to copy his price tag, which is five dimes and two pennies. That was awfully nice of Grumpy Cat to, to agree to do that. And then secondly, we have Spotty Cat, and there's Spotty Cat right there. He agreed to be sold for 34 cents. So we're going to write Spotty, which is S-P-O-T-T-Y, and that's three dimes and four pennies. Okay, so we'll put them aside. So um, we're gonna go ahead and add that up. So we have four plus two, so four fingers here, two fingers over here, let's add those all together. One, two, three, four, five, six. So that is six pennies right here. And how many dimes would we need? Okay, so we have five and three. So five on this hand and three on this hand. Let's count those all together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So um, 86 cents. At the cat store, we'll buy you Grumpy Cat and Spotty Cat. That's a pretty good deal, I think. Okay, so we're gonna take them out of the way. The next store is a book store. So we're going to write book at the top, B-O-O-K. That's one of our um, short diagraph O-O words that we wrote today. Okay, so the first book that um, Little Blackie picked out is um, Jesus Loves the Little Children. And that book right there is 60 cents okay so we're just gonna put Jesus right here just because that'll be short J E S U S that'll help us identify this book and it's 60 cents so that's six dimes and zero pennies okay and then the next book that was chosen was a book on trucks okay so we're going to write the word trucks T R U C Okay, S, okay, trucks. Okay, and if you turn that over, that is 29 cents. So two dimes and nine pennies. Okay, so once you've got that written, then we're going to do the math to see how much you would need all together to take both of these books home from the bookstore. Okay, let's go ahead and do that math now. So first we have to add up the pennies, so zero plus nine. Well, when you don't add anything, when you put a zero in an addition problem with the number, that it, the number stays the same. So we're not taking any away, we're just, we're not adding anything, we're just keeping it at nine. So you need nine pennies. And then we need six dimes and two dimes here. So if you, you have six right here, pop out two more fingers, one, two, and how many do you have all together? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So you need 89 cents right here, 89 cents all together to take home your books today. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed that lesson today. Um, Little Blackie had a lot of fun convincing his two cats to become part of this lesson today. Um, 
Good job today on your math, and we'll see you again in this book tomorrow.